Good evening. It is Wednesday, uh, January 19th, and I just realized that I've, like, filmed nothing today. It's been a super busy day. Um, so I just, I don't know, I just slipped my mind. Anyways, um, I thought I'd show you some of the bread. Um, one of the couples that has been coming to our church, I think I might have mentioned this before, they own a bakery. And somehow... I, in the first time in six years, somebody got me to um, uh, agree to teach their kid English. Well, actually, I'm not really teaching him English. He actually speaks a little and he reads, he can read it. Like, he can read English, but as I worked with him about three times now. And so she asked if she could bring him when I do homeschool with the girls. And so I've already got a curriculum that I use with them. So I'm using the same thing with him. And I can tell that he, although he can pronounce the words he's reading, he doesn't know what he's reading. So we're working on his pronunciation, his phonics, um, we're doing a little bit of language arts, and then I'm having him read, and we're talking about what he's reading. So anyways, and she is paying me in bread. She brought this bag of breads, and this one was much bigger. <laughs> it was like this big, but we've already put a good hurt on it. It was cream cheese filled, and it was like soft is my favorite kind. You can you have a treat? Did you finish your dinner? No, you didn't finish your dinner. If you want to finish your dinner, then you can. Somebody just said that. So anyways, just thought I would show you my bread payment. <laughs> Good morning. It is Thursday morning, uh, February 20th, 2020. Oh my goodness. I accidentally bought a maternity shirt. <laughs> I thought that the uh, brand was really funny. The name of the brand, Pre Mama. And so I was going to show it to you. I thought that was really funny. And then I looked at the tag and it's got a pregnant lady on it. I accidentally bought a maternity shirt. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> okay, so the only thing even remotely maternity about this is that it's just kind of long, I guess which used to be the style for a long time anyways, so I don't know. So anyways, there's my maternity shirt. Not pregnant. Not, not pregnant. The mall doing some errands. The mall now has a dog park. I guess you can bring dogs into the mall and bring them to the dog park. I just thought that was interesting. It looks like a playground. Like if we came here, my kids would want to be in here playing with these things and doing and pretending to be dogs. So kind of funny. All right, so I'm on my way out to pick up um, Lila. Ellie doesn't get out for another hour and a half, basically. And then Jeremy and I are gonna go on a date. Real quick here, I wanna show you what I, that I finally put something above my bed. My bed's not super made right now, but there's my bed. But anyways, I've got some pictures and some of these Christmas lights that I got the other day at the grocery store for super cheap. And I went through all our pictures that we had copies of. I don't have any frames for them. But I thought this would be fun. I put this up so we finally have something above our bed. Oh, Alright, so we're out at a place called Lenya y Carbone, which means, what does that mean? It's uh, maybe firewood and charcoal? Something like that, yeah. We're like the only ones in here. It's a really pretty place. It's a little too chilly to sit outside. And in fact, they have a fire going. We were sitting outside, but we moved in because it's just, like I said, just a little too chilly. We have a pretty view um, in that direction through there. That's actually city lights. So anyway, and I've got a um, not alcoholic. It's just a potato, which is like a blended drink. Blended drink. <laughs> my, my English left. I've got pineapple and Jeremy's got a strawberry. We've got some onion rings here that look kind of like artisanal if I had to describe them and then some sauces that we don't know what they are that one's a little spicy but it's good all right so I have pollo suizo which is grilled chicken with cheese it's got a little corn plantain some salad and some potatoes and then Jeremy. Else on that. Here. I've got chicken here you do it my hands are greasy oh sorry <laughs> got beef pork no I think that's the pork and that's the chicken a uh, grilled potato and some kind of salad, some onions, and uh, a sweet plantain and some corn. Okay, so that was our date night, and it was brief, but we enjoyed it. Um, anyways, 
And now we're home, kids are in bed, and I just finished putting pretty much the finishing touches on my packing because tomorrow, Elijah and I are headed to the United States for a very brief trip and just Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then we come back Monday. So we're flying out Friday, coming back Monday. So I've got just a little, I've got a, one carry-on. I could actually bring two, but I decided not to bother because I can fit everything in one and I have to bring everything back. And I am paying for a um, full-size um, checked bag on the way back. So I've got that. I've got my backpack over here is my personal item. And then I have um, my liquids, just a little bit of liquids. And then instead of a stroller, because I realized I cannot roll a carry-on, which I'm hoping, I'm going to try to gate check it, or not gate check it, I'm going to try to check it at the counter. They may let me, they've let me before, but, and then I'm bringing this so that I don't have to worry about um, a stroller. I can strap him in. <laughs> so anyways, you'll definitely, I'll be definitely filming as much of that as I can. We'll see with Elijah if I can or if I can't. But anyways, so I think we're ready. Basically... Take the girls to school in the morning and then we'll go to the airport. So exciting times. Oh, the reason I'm going is I'm going back for the memorial service um, for my grandparents. It's actually for both of them. They were um, both cremated, which is a little hard to deal with, but it is what it is. It was their wishes. And um, we've uh, they've kept my grandfather's ashes and they're both going to be interred or buried together on Sunday. So that is why I'm going back and I should get to see a lot of the family that I don't normally get to see. So hopefully it'll be good. So anyways, that's it for this video and I hope you enjoyed.